May is Stroke Awareness Month, and yesterday I sat down with a stroke survivor who is thriving after his life was turned upside down. Strokes can happen at any age, and my next guest suffered two strokes at the age of 46. Now he's written a book about his experience. It's called A Stroke of Faith, a stroke survivor's story of a second chance at living a life of significance. Mark Moore is an American Stroke Association ambassador. Thank you so much for coming in and taking some time. So tell me about this experience. At age 46, you go through a life-changing event. Well, thank you very much for having me this morning, Rachel. And yes, at age of 46, the Saturday before Mother's Day, I suffered my first stroke. While I was still in the hospital, the Monday after Mother's Day, I suffered a second stroke. The second stroke caused complications and then they had to perform life-saving brain surgery. Wow, so talk to me about how you, were, how you were living before, healthy, active? Yes, I was healthy and active. As a matter of fact, the Saturday, the Thursday before that Saturday, as I had been doing every day for five years, I played basketball for two hours with, with 20 of my closest friends. Um, uh, and exercise, ate well, you know, I was healthy. Um, as a matter of fact, because I was healthy, I think it helped in the recovery because I was relatively healthy to speak. But I developed a blood deficiency and because of the blood deficiency, my blood clot, and that's what caused the two strokes. Okay, so how is the recovery process? Because we know it can run the gamut on stroke recovery. The recovery can be very difficult. Um, I ended up being in hospital for six weeks in a medically induced coma. And after I finished the six weeks hospitalization, I found myself with, um, I couldn't walk. Um, I had significant weakness on the left side and I lost peripheral vision on the left side. So it, it was, it's a long, it's a long, difficult process. I ended up having to go through two months of rehabilitation in order to completely recover physical therapy, speech therapy, and occupational therapy. But with a lot of help from others and, and a tremendous faith, I was able to come back with a full recovery. Right, and that's part of your book. Why did you want to write your book and talk about your experience? Well, well I'll be honest with you. Um, most people, when they have strokes, a lot of people don't want to talk about the stroke experience. And that was new to me because after I had finished with my recovery, I went back to the rehab place I stayed at, and I was asking some of the physical therapists and occupational therapists and speech therapists, well, how are some of the other folks doing? And they said to me, uh, we don't know. And I'm like, well, what do you mean you don't know? And they're like, well, Mark, I'll be honest with you, because most people don't come back here after they've had a stroke. They want to forget that they've ever had a stroke. And actually, it was really surprising to me. And I'm like, really? And they're like, yeah, people want to forget this part of their life. I chose I didn't want to forget the part of my life. And as I went through this process and realized that I had been tremendously blessed with a full recovery, I wanted to really help others to come to the realization that, you know, you could suffer two strokes and have major brain surgery and you st and you can still have a full recovery and have a wonderful life. Right, and you've actually done quite a bit since. That's correct. What what are you how are you staying active? You know, you know, I was tremendously blessed. Um, I was very very fortunate three and a half, after having two strokes and major brain surgery, three and a half months later, I was able to return to work. Mm -hmm. um, and in less than a year later, I was able to run a 5K wow. in downtown DC. And I never ran in my life, so that was all new to me. Um, so, but I really want people to realize that, you know what, you can have a full active life. Wow, well hopefully people read your book and get some inspiration and show that you really can be healthy and active even after stroke. It doesn't have to define that, you. That is correct. Life doesn't change. All right, and where can people get this book? Um, if, uh, actually, you can buy the book anywhere. Okay. Um, anywhere books are sold. Um, and if they want to know lo more about what I'm doing, they go to my website, astrokeoffaith.com. Okay, and we'll have all that information on our website, wcco.com. Thank you so much for coming in and sharing this. Thank you very much. I appreciate it. Really appreciate it.